Princess Ray is here. I am here to talk about a few helmets. Uh, some of mine, some of my boyfriends. Uh, we are slowly going over to uh, Bell Helmet. Still an Icon fan. I know he probably still is. Uh, he has the Icon Lucky's helmet, not the black one, the white one, not the brand new one, which the brand new one is pretty cool. Um, and I have the the cheetah one, the not the sparkly cheetah, but the the shiny cheetah one. And now I have my bell helmet. So I love my bell helmet, super dope. Um, and it's carbon. I love my carbon. Um, I'm slowly turning carbon on the bike, so be more carbon here and there. Um, it has the transitional lens on it, which I love. Uh, I don't have to worry about when we go out riding during the day if we got to switch my helmet or, or not switch my helmet but switch my lens. Um, I don't have to worry about carrying it which is kind of sucks carrying an extra lens on the bike. I know you probably know how it is but it's not that fun and plus there's nowhere to put it so you either sacrifice riding all day with a clear lens so you can ride that night or you sacrifice riding with dark lens and then racing at night with a dark lens which is not that fun because I cannot see so I like the transitional one um the only thing I don't like about it is if it's partly cloudy outside that it's completely clear and I don't like that very much I still like somewhat of a tent so super sensitive to light um but yeah, I, I love it. Also, I do have a Cena on it. I was able to fit a Cena in it since I got small ears. Sort of, kind of, you know, whatever. My earrings get in the way, that's the only thing. Um, but I did, I did, I did, I did put a Cena in it. Um, and it fits really good. All you have to do is just, these are magnetic, so super easy. Um, and they have like little holes where your ears go, so since my ears aren't big. They just fit right in the middle. Um, so yeah, I, lo I love my bell helmet. I do like my icon. I actually, I love my icon. But bell is slowly winning my heart over. So, yeah, my bell helmet. And it's carbon. Did I mention that? I'm pretty sure I mentioned that. Um, so story about this one um this is not mine this is my boyfriend's boosted catfish he he and i went down to atlanta for a race event the two weekends ago and he's had his helmet i bought his helmet three years ago for christmas well it's getting to the point where he's tired of it but doesn't want to give it away or doesn't want to sell it or put it up yet because he knows it'll hurt my feelings which, I mean, whatever, it's been three years, you can get rid of it by now. Another reason is there's one other person here in Charlotte, because that, that's where we live, um, that has the Lucky's helmet, and he hates it. He's like, I want to be the only one that has the helmet. So, we went to Atlanta, and we went to Mountain Motorsports for a meetup with 650EB, um, EJR Performance, Dr. Gap, and I don't think I know anyone else that was there. Those are just the big people that I know. Um, and I'm at Busa on Instagram. But anyways, we went there looking at helmets. I told them that they have a really cool helmet inside. It wasn't Bell. It was something else. I can't remember the name of it, but it had a big eyeball on top. Super cool helmet. Super bright and everything. Well, he saw this helmet and he's like, oh, I, I want that helmet. We find out how much it was and it was super super expensive so we walked away a dude came up and asked um what we wanted and we told him like that helmet's super cool he's like all right i'll take 20 percent off for you so he did and we went out we went to go check out and he's like wait the reason why he doesn't hold on let me back up the reason why he doesn't like his icon helmet is because he can't talk very good on his uh bmw it's just not a good helmet to race with on with his icon so he wanted a bell because this one ah, I'm just gonna keep spinning this one hi cutie was amazing for him um, he loved it it's bell also carbon and white hi puppies um, but 
he went down on it and ruined the helmet. So he can't wear that one anymore. So he, before he bought that one, he actually bought a transitional lens for it. Before he um, ruined that one, he bought a transitional lens for it, but never put it on. Well, I went out and got a bell helmet and I ended up taking the transitional lens from him. A few weeks later, stop, no, 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 no paw. Uh, a few weeks later, we go to Atlanta and he buys this one. So now he wants his transitional lens back. Leo, what is your deal, buddy? Okay, kitty, stop licking me. So he loves his helmet. I love it too because I can see him whenever we're driving down the street or if we're with a bunch of other people. Yes. So I can see him if we're with a bunch of other people because when we went down to Atlanta, I couldn't find him at all. And he wasn't even on his Beamer because he um, he has a pink BMW, a half pink, half black BMW. Leo, you got to chill out, buddy. Um, stop it. No. Um, so I looked around for him. Leo. Stop it. Looked around for him, couldn't find him, and all I had to do was just look for his bright ass helmet. So that's what I did, because I forgot that um, he had got that one and not the, he doesn't have his white Lucky's one icon anymore. So another reason why I like the brightness of it is because I can find him. Um, I don't know if he's gonna put his Cena on it or not from his Lucky's helmet. Yes. Um, but I know it'll fit, I don't know with his big old head, but I know it fits mine, so whatever. He also has a clear lens, he took my dark and clear lens that goes to that helmet, that goes to my bell helmet, so it fit that one. Um, Leo, get down, get down, don't step on Katie. This is the beautiful helmet, I love it, so bright, he is actually thinking about painting the bike a different color. I don't know what color yet, but it will be a different color. We are taking the pink off because October is over and it was for breast cancer awareness for a car show that we went to. And um, what? Lay down. But I love it. I absolutely love the color. I love how bright it is. And it's a flex. Uh, thank you Mountain Motorsports for hooking us up with that. Also, when you get a bell helmet, you get this cool ass uh, bag. We have about three or four of them running around the house now. I love it. Super easy. I love it. Um, you don't have, like when you go on road trips or something like that, or you have a big, big enclosed trailer, you can easily just put your helmets in there and you don't have to worry about them getting messed up or scratched or their lens scratched or banging up. Like, it's so easy. So since we do not have a Mountain Motorsports around us in Charlotte, they are located in Atlanta. Um, they sent us a little gift bag or gift box thing uh, with all kinds of stuff in it. So we are going to look at what they sent us because I haven't looked at it yet. Um, so yeah. long drop so they sent us a bag which is awesome because oh, oh there's stuff inside of it huh. um, they sent us a bag it's pretty cool okay so the reason why I like these types of bags um, they don't blow out like a parachute when I have stuff in it while I'm trying to ride um, a big thing for me is I like to ride to work sometimes and I have to carry a backpack. And the backpack that I have is not super, super big, but I mean, it's still kind of big. And I even tighten it all the way down and it still like blows out and it's like a little parachute. If I were to hit it, then I'd go off the bike and bye, see you later. It's like one of those parachutes that are on the back of the car when you're going down the drugstore. It would be bad. But anyways, I like these bags. Here it is. Love it. I don't know what your deal is, but calm down, baby. Um, they sent us a, um, a koozie. Sorry. Koozie. Ah, koozie. Yeah. 
Bill probably got to the shop because I like drinking beer when I got to the shop. Um, they sent us playing cards. Oh, that's cool. Well, it's kind of open. Okay. They sent us playing cards. I like it. Ooh, Joker. Um, oh, let me put it back in the box because I will lose it. Oh, keychains. They sent us keychains. That's cute. I love keychains. Just so you know, I absolutely love keychains. They, um, I got about 20 on my, uh, my car keys and I got three on my, no, two on my bike keys. It's like, it's funny because on my bike key, there's a keychain on it and it's a little motorcycle. And it's a bottle opener. I don't drink when I ride but I liked it because it was a, um, a motorcycle and it's super super tiny it's probably about the same size as this well the other day I was looking at my bike key and I was looking at the keychain and it's actually a lawyer for a uh, motorcycle like uh, like if you were just ca get caught speeding or something on the bike and it was, it was a motorcycle lawyer I believe but it was super funny because I have it on my keychain on my bike key Whatever. And then my car keys, I got a bunch of, a bunch of, uh, keychains. I like keychains a lot, so. What else do we have? Ooh, chapstick. It's getting cold outside, so, uh, you're gonna need some chapstick with them chapped lips. Um, I, I like chapstick. Definitely the quarter months. Uh, that past week in Atlanta was kind of brutal because we rode in the cold. I don't do writing in the cold at all. Um, I mean, it's all right, but if the sun's out, but once that sun goes down, I live out in the country where you don't want to get caught writing in the cold because it's cold, cold. What a Leo. Um, we also got t-shirts. Those are cute. This your front. Super cute. In the back, Mountain Motorsports. And they smell, they smell good. Mountain Motorsports. We got one of these. Oh, so you notice that they are kind of big. Um, I like bigger t-shirts because I like walking around with just a t-shirt on. I'm not a fan of pants, but whatever. Um, and we got another one. Um, I like being comfortable around the house and big t-shirts are, I don't know, comfortable for me. My boyfriend gets mad at me all the time. Like, oh, what t-shirt are you wearing today? Or, um, we'll go out, I'll, or we'll go out to eat or something or go out to Lowe's and buy stuff and I'll just be wearing his t-shirt. He's like, don't you have your own t-shirts? What, what is, whatever. What is your deal? Do you want to go out? Come on, I'll let you out of room. Go. Bye. He is an attention whore. Okay. So, another t shirt. Super cute. And another t shirt. Super cute. Now I have my own t-shirts, that way my boyfriend doesn't have to get mad at me. Thank you so much, Mountain Motorsports. Um, we love the helmet. Love, love, love. We wish you guys were up here closer to us. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Hopefully we'll be able to come back down to Atlanta really soon. Um, I believe we have a trip sometime next year going down to Miami. So hopefully we'll stop by. Mountain Motorsports and get some, pick something up there. Huge shout out to my boyfriend letting me borrow his helmets, or helmet, his other helmet. Um, Boosted Catfish, thank you so much. Um, if you guys like the video, please like, comment, and share, and subscribe. And you should subscribe, definitely subscribe. Thank you so, so, so much for watching my video. XOXO.